And breaking developments after police shooting leaves an officer and the suspect injured. But that's not all. Neighbors had to be evacuated after officers spotted the suspect's home in flames. Michelle Nix picks up the story from here. It all began early this morning in North Olmstead when an unidentified woman called 911 saying a man approached her with blood on him. He said someone was trying to kill his uncle. When officers arrived, they found a home engulfed in flames and a man armed with a weapon. That's when the suspect exchanged gunfire with police. We got a fire. Are hitting the arm. Just like now, we got a gunpoint. The violent night illuminated by this raging house fire on Alden Drive, where the suspect reportedly lived. A North Olmsted police officer was shot twice. The man police say had a gun, critically wounded. Both rushed to the hospital after a short foot chase through yards, and shots fired just before two in the morning. I'm shocked. I am just. I can't believe it. I never thought this would happen ever, ever in my life. The drama centered around what is now just the burnt out shell of a home. Gwen, who lives next door, asked that we not use her last name, but she says she was forced to evacuate her home along with other families as a precaution. The North Olmsted woman says whoever lived in the house had been unusually quiet. That is until Saturday morning. We did not see any people. Um, no, uh, no, nothing. It, like nothing. That. Mm -mm. We, and it was quite. It's been quiet over there. So I don't know. This is an all of a sudden. We don't know. Sources say the suspect, who is related to the home's owner, was allegedly being evicted. Gwen tells me her son spotted the raging fire after hearing what they now believe were gunshots. He was gaming with his friends with his headphones on. He heard. Boom, boom, boom. A neighborhood rattled by a police shooting and devastating house fire. Thankful the wounded police officer was released from the hospital, but concerned about why a neighbor put the community in danger. I was just floored. I was in an unbelievable, I can't believe this is happening mode. Neighbors here in North Olmsted want to know how this house fire and the police shooting are connected, and they want to know what led up to all of this. The state fire marshal and Ohio BCI are investigating. Reporting in North Olmsted, Michelle Nix, 19 News. Now